Hi everyone, in this video we'll perform a pressure loss calculation and show the result in 2D and 3D view. Before viewing the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to hit the bell to be notified of the new videos. Enjoy! Since my duct system is connected to an net handling unit, a calculation point has been set automatically. Otherwise, we could use the function set a calculation point. In this case, I will come to the building function and access the pressure loss calculation tab, in which we see the available uh, calculation points. So I will select this one and click start. In the config tab, we see the preview of the, of the current status of our duct system. On the right, we see uh, input parameters, such as the velocity limits and the minimum dimensions. On the tab calculation, we also see the current status is activated. We can calculate uh, our system by adding transitions without adding additional transitions or only adjust our terminals and dumpers. In this case, I don't want to resize my model. I only want to show uh, the results of the velocity in each duct segment. We see already in the preview that from the limits that I from the velocity limits that I have inserted as maximum of three meters per second and minimum one, the values that are slightly or under the the minimum ve velocity, and in red we see the the values that exceed the limit. So I will click calculate and in the menu view and call visualize system state and velocity level, we can show in the model the same uh, values that exceed the limit. In green, we see the values that are within the limits and in blue, the, vo the values that are under the limit. We can also activate this in a 3D model. Else, we can also make use of intelligent text to show the velocity in the model. So I select the duct segment and I come to the part text function and I will select the predefined text duct rectangular flow and velocity. If you like this video, share with your colleagues. If you have any questions or any suggestions about this video, put your comment below and we get back to you. Cheers!